Hey everybody, Smart Silver Stacker here. In today's video, I'm going to be demonstrating a unique property of silver that can help you when testing your bullion for fakes or counterfeits. And what I have right here to help me perform this test are some super strong neodymium magnets. And I picked these up on Amazon a while ago to help with magnet tests. Uh, there's a link in the description if you want to get yourself a set of these. They're really good for this test and really any kind of magnet test that you're going to be performing because they're small and they have a super strong magnetic field. So of course one kind of magnet test you can perform with these is to test for ferrous metals like iron or nickel because they will definitely stick to those metals. If you're testing copper or silver, those are not ferromagnetic, so these magnets will not stick to those metals. But those metals are diamagnetic. And what that means is that when a strong magnet moves near the metal, a magnetic field is induced in the opposite direction, creating a repulsive force. And what that means for us in practice is that if I slide this magnet down my silver bar, it's going to move very slowly. And I'll demonstrate that for you. You can see how slowly that magnet is moving down the silver bar. And just to give you a comparison, this is how quickly it will slide down a book. Very fast. That's at the same angle. Now, silver has a fairly high diamagnetic constant, meaning that this effect is particularly noticeable with silver. And here's a chart from the Wikipedia article on diamagnetism with the diamagnetic constant of some notable materials. As you can see, lead and copper are both also diamagnetic, but less so than silver. So if we take this magnet and slide it down this two kilo copper bar, we can see that it still moves slowly, but the effect is noticeably less pronounced than with the silver bar. And I don't have a lead bar to demonstrate this with, but if you were to use one, it would be similar to the copper bar, and the difference is significant enough to differentiate bars made out of the different metals. And this property of silver can be helpful in identifying fake silver bullion, as there are some fakes out there made of materials like lead, copper, or another base metal coated in a thin layer of silver. Another metal sometimes used to make fake bullion is molybdenum, as it is very close to silver in density. But bars made out of molybdenum will not exhibit this diamagnetic effect at all. An important word of caution is that this test may not be very useful in identifying large silver bars that have been partially hollowed out and filled with a base metal. The outer shell of silver may be enough to create the diamagnetic effect, rendering this test ineffective for spotting fake silver bars of that nature. But if you want one more tool in your arsenal for assaying and testing silver bullion, pick up some neodymium magnets, and you can do this test yourself at home. And if you enjoyed this video, and you want some more tips for avoiding counterfeit bullion, then check out this video right here. So that pretty much wraps this video up. Thank you all very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Smart Silver Stacker, out.